Hey there, if you want to add some further categories into your Shopify website, you are in the right place. So first of all, what you guys need to do is to sign up totally for free. Now, if you don't have a Shopify account, you don't have to worry about that because I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description and you can have a great trial mode totally for free for the next 30 days. Now, now that I'm here into my Shopify account and you want to create yourself a website, here you can see your home section, your order section, your products, and where we want to focus in here, it doesn't matter if you don't have a online store yet. I mean, if you don't have that set it already, uh, you don't have to worry about that. We want to make some categories into our product, right? So what I want to do first of all is to go here into the product section, as you can see, it's right in here. So after I clicked in this option, What's going to happen is here, first up, what are you selling? So if you don't have any products, you can just add that uh, into your Shopify merch. Let's say, for example, I have just one uh, demo t-shirt. All right. So now what I want to do is to add another product just to uh, make this, for example, pant uh, shoes one, right? I'm going to click into save. So let's say for example you have these two products and you don't have to be aware about the product it's how it's on the inventory i mean you can fill that uh for yourselves so what i want to do is to choose a product and in here what i want to do is to look for this option it says product category so here you have clothing right so i'm going to choose clothing and the product type is going to be appearing i'm going to be putting here let's say for example t-shirt depending on the product you'll be selling so here it is, Vendo. So in here, it's going to put in here my name, at Steve. And if you want to add a collections, I strongly suggest you guys to add this for a specific collection. Let's say, for example, I can use T-shirts. And in here, it's going to be appearing. I'm going to be deleting this option. Click into Enter. And then what I want to do is to hit into Save. And into the second item, I'm going to choose once again this option. So I can choose their own product category. I'm going to be using the same option here in accessories. And here I'm going to choose shoes, right? So if you want to change the band though, in my case, I want to stick around with my, my own and here into the collections, I want to put it here into the home page. I'm, I'm going to hit into save. If you want to create a new collection, if you want to manage your collections as your own product category, you can go back. And here into the product section, I'm going to scroll down until I find the collections option so I can see here the home page. So what I want to do is to create a collection of a t-shirt, for example. And here I'm going to scroll load down and select the collection type, use the manual option, go to edit. And here I can put in here the collection that I want to add into, well, my collection of my first website so i can go back and here i can see that there's my collection and now i can just add an image if i want to let's say to modify it or something like that and click into save and you are just good to go if you want just to mess around with the design the all of that you can go into the sales channel go into the online store and here into the themes you want to customize your website and you are good to go so there you have it guys it was in daha just in case you have any questions you can leave it down below in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video guys and well i will see you next time